Hi everyone, this is Xavier and today we are reviewing a top, top book of mine, Genius by James Bannerman. It is a fantastic book on how to think differently. It has helped me enormously and well, I guess my mind was already messed up before this book, but this really dug even deeper. So first of all, what is genius? Well, in this book, uh, the author gives the definition that genius is a skill, actually. That is about inventing or thinking new ways or new ideas. Uh, Albert Einstein was saying that actually imagination is more important than knowledge. And that is really uh, the core of, of this book. And um, another quote uh, from Cervantes, the author of Don Quixote. Uh, in order to attain the impossible, one must attempt the absurd. <laughs> that really summarizes the entire book on how it takes you for a ride and gives you a lot, a lot of tools and techniques on how to solve problems from small ones to the big ones, as well as historical facts on how some things have been invented. Uh, really, really enjoyable read. So this book goes into um, five uh, different concepts uh, around cunning and cunning uh, really in the pure sense of it. That is really about uh, finding a very uh, smart way of doing things. So uh, cunning can do, C-A-N-D-O. That stands for cunning connections, cunning alterations, cunning navigations, cunning directions, and cunning oppositions. And the point in each of them is to make connections in new ways, in different ways that our brains might not be used to. I've had great results uh, at work uh, by using some of these techniques uh, in, in the work environment, uh, managing millions of dollars uh, property that uh, was really, really impressive. Um, so the, 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 the first one, really, uh, connections, right? So one example that the author is giving um, is uh, people sometimes, uh, while well, I was suffering from that as well, is the memory loss for certain things that I uh, thought were not really interesting, uh, not very important for me. And uh, making the connections, right? Um, so the example was uh, one person could not remember uh, the, the, the birth date of, uh, of another, and which was May 4th. And um, uh, he made the connection uh, with Star Wars by saying, May the 4th be with you. That is um, uh, also a technique that Tony Buzan, who's uh, uh, um, a summit in uh, how the mind works and how to improve uh, uh, capabilities, uh, mental capabilities, has been, uh, has been using as well as been recommending. So very, very interesting one. In um, alteration. Alteration really is how to make something that already exists and transform it into something else. That's how the Great Wall of China was created. It started with a wall and decided to make it longer uh, for protection. The mobile phone, the ancient mobile phone, I still remember my parents coming back from, um, I believe it was uh, Sevilla in the um, uh, uh, Universal Exposition where they saw the first mobile phone ever and the person was talking by himself and he had a big machine there like this, alterating to the normal size phone that we have now. Okay, even this one is a bit big, but that is uh, into an iPod size. These are the alterations. The, the switch that used to be there, the on and off switch that turned out into becoming a, um, a, a circular one. Guess what? That's also how the safety pin was created. The safety pin was originally uh, just a, a, a straight uh, pin and that instead of uh, pricking yourself, that, that the inventor actually twisted it so that you could uh, safely and not prick your finger anymore. A lot of things can be changed like that just by altering the current 
item that you're looking for or also altering uh, your business alter the clientele so as um, a director of strategy in one of my previous hotels uh, I went through an exercise like this and I drew on I still remember it was on the window actually uh, for my team to uh, to think about and I said okay so this is the uh, current situation we have a bucket we're pouring water our clients our revenue uh, but that water is leaking at the bottom of the, the bucket so what can we do to stop that we went into changing the size of the bucket making it larger so obviously what would happen the water would still pour in but still the bucket would be still uh, leaking um, putting some band-aids uh, adding new things and the uh, final solution that we decided to go with is actually altering the quality of the water altering the clientele that we were having so we decided to um, say no to certain type of clientele that ended up being leaking right to other types of clientele by changing the composition of the water or the clientele that we were having very effective and i guarantee you we had amazing results actually for that uh, for that property beating many many records navigation navigation uh, cunning navigation is about uh, going on an exploratory uh, exploratory mode uh, looking at things anew that's how um, from leaves a pack of leaves we ended up with pringles um, um, a thigh bone uh, ended up putting upside down ended up the, like the eiffel tower um, the crane cranes dancing in china ended up being one of the very famous uh, kung fu styles navigation is an approach that is not easy for people who've been working in the same industry or in the same jobs for a very long time however if you manage to do that uh, nonetheless you will have very interesting um, insights uh, and sparks of uh, ingenuity cunning direction is about changing the direction of the problem changing the direction of the issue this is something that we uh, learn very uh, in depth really by practicing ourselves in martial arts instead of running away from the attacker in some martial arts we're encouraging actually the person to go towards the attacker um, uh, that's more in karate in aikido you would receive the attacker and instead of blocking it you keep it and you change the direction of the attacker so that that person ends up um, uh, on the floor and uh, out of uh, and in control you controlling that person uh, the cap I don't know if you remember back in the uh, in the 80s 90s people started to wear the cap instead of having it with the uh, with the, uh, the the front uh, in, on the forehead start putting on the side or even in the back right um, these are changes of direction uh, there's a very funny example about uh, uh, Superman uh, instead of having uh, underpants put them put the underpants over <laughs> they become overpants uh, over the tights cunning uh, opposition is the last one of the list and that is a very interesting one that is uh, finding the absolute opposite of what you're facing just imagine that whatever you're facing it turn it upside down i ended up um and and ended up uh, doing some uh, projections uh, by laying down on the floor just by changing my position my perceptual position um, looking at things completely differently that's how we ended up from ironing shirts to non-iron shirts that's how you ended up from uh, football to rugby um, that's how we ended up from uh, eyeglasses to lenses so these uh, each of these steps really are um, helping us steering our creativity and what is creativity really if it's not looking at the old thing in a new way so for example imagine an animal that you've never seen before well you will say it's new actually it's not 
You cannot imagine something completely new that you've never seen before. Breaking it down small enough, you will see that each part of that animal are already in your head somehow, somewhere. So it is only about rearranging things in a new way, in a new fashion that will make you be creative, that will stretch your mind and your brain into new ways of thinking and that will help you have more genius moments. So think about one of these processes that is uh, attractive for you and there's a lot more after that. There's about, well, 26 for each of the uh, letter of the alphabet, 26 different processes uh, to play with. But right now in here, I will ask you to choose one of these connections, alteration, navigation, direction or opposition. Take one very, very small thing in your life, anything, even not necessarily a problem. Just take a pencil and use one of these processes and make it something else make it something new try to stretch your brain take it with a, a popsicle stick what can you do with this too have fun with that and stay centered <laughs>